Hey guys, what's up? In this video, I want to show you how to style an upload file button. If you'll notice, uh, an upload file button is displayed natively by whichever browser a user happens to be in, and there's actually no way to style it beyond, um, well, there's really no way to style it. It's similar to a radio button. A radio button, is, it displays the same way all the time. So it's a common question that one wonders how to actually style something like that. So what you have to do is you have to actually give it uh, two input IDs because one you're going to display and one you're going to hide. And the one that you're going to hide is the actual file upload button. But the, what we're going to do is add a little bit of JavaScript so that when you click on that um, button, you're actually clicking on the hidden file upload button. So you, that way you can uh, style the button on top of it any way that you want and it looks like an upload file button and it operates the same exact way. So to give you an idea on what I'm talking about, it's actually pretty simple. We're just going to say uh, input, we'll give it a class name, and I'll call this display none, and we'll give it an ID, we'll call it file, type equals file, which means file upload size equals four. This is actually the only way you can size a file upload button is using uh, the standard HTML name. We're going to go ahead and name it file. And then that's that input button. Now, uh, what we're going to do is add, this is the button that we're actually going to show, and we're going to call this upload button type equals button class equals. We'll just call it button as well. Value equals upload file. So now, if I go ahead and run this application. So when we run it, you can see that we have the two files side by side. Now, what we're going to do is go ahead and actually hide this choose file button because this is the standard upload, and then this does nothing. So what we're going to do is we're actually going to make this operate this way. So the next step here, let's go back to our editor. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to add some style to go ahead and hide the... Uh, display none so let's go ahead and add that class now I'm assuming you were going to put this in the sort some sort of external style sheet I'm just keeping it in the same file for brevity or brevity brevity to make make it easy basically <laughs> All right, so we're gonna say display none and now let's go ahead and put some JavaScript at the end of the file I'm gonna go ahead and do some jQuery here document dot ready document dot ready function what this is saying is um javascript waiting it says wait till the page loads then go ahead and and try to operate okay so let's go ahead and say variable interval function actually equals function Say file what do we call this uh, we gave it an ID file so we'll say file dot HTML Value. Okay. All right. Now let's go ahead and close that off and fire the other function. Let's say upload button for our ID. Dot on. Click. Function. file dot click set interval interval function one oh shit one and return false 
Let's close off our jQuery statement. All right, let's go back and um, fire this application and see what happens. Uh, before we fire this up, I do notice that we have one issue here. The comma needs to be replaced with a semicolon. And now let's go ahead and, and start this and see what we get. All right, so as you can see here, we have the upload file button, which is being displayed over top of the actual file upload. And the styling that we can apply to the button will appear as if we're styling the file upload button. The JavaScript we're using is um, causing the button to have the same, uh, f same functionality as the file upload. So by clicking this, you can see that it launches the file upload option. So just to give a brief example on if you've ever tried to style the file upload button, you can see here that like I can change the color of this pretty easily just by um, going back to my application here or my editor. So I can come up here and, and for my upload button, I can give it some additional style. In fact, I'll just leave it as a class of button and we'll say background color and color uh, so we're basically saying turn it turn it white we'll get rid of the border too border none and border radius three pixels all right so this should round our button make it look pretty nice and let me go back to the application and if i reload the page you can see that it is now using the button style. So it's pretty sweet. It's an easy way to upload. We obviously want to change the width, padding, put some border in there, whatever you want to do. And you would want to add uh, CSS for hover so that it turns into a little mount, a hand pointer when you go over top of the upload file button. But that's, that's a good way to go about styling a file upload button. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe. Have a good day.